Hallelujah. Happy Thanksgiving every day. We got here this morning before daylight, which, which we do every morning, by the way. I'm addicted. I'm obsessed. I'm full of the hunting life. I hunt too much. Nobody ever said. I certainly don't. So Bob set this double bull blind up right up in the front corral, right by the barn. And we've been skunked like six days in a row. Six mornings, six afternoons. I got a beautiful buck the first night home. Then I got a beautiful doe the next morning. And then we've been skunked. But last night, Shemaine sent a beautiful arrow into a giant African oryx. 600 pound animal. Which, by the way, the Symmetra horned oryx, like a lot of exotic species are thriving in Texas because private landowners value them as a renewable resource. I know in one and one equals two, but a lot of people don't know that. Where you don't hunt the oryx in Africa, there's no hunting money to pay for game wardens and management. So they kill them all so they can grow goats and chickens and avocados. Whereas landowners in Texas designate millions of private acres of perfect habitat to all sorts of Asian and African uh, and exotic game from around the world. And the scimitar horned oryx is thriving in Texas on ranches where you hunt because we harvest the surplus every year. Happy Thanksgiving. And the value pays for the incentive instead of growing longhorn cattle and goats. You know, 2020, we're getting into 2020, and the author of Wango Tango has to explain sustained yield, habitat carrying capacity, population dynamics, and hands-on conservation renewable value. I know most of you know this, but there are a lot of people out there that reject the information. So I'm going to continue to celebrate it. But this morning is a perfect spirit of the wild morning. Shemaine shot that 600 pound antelope with a 35 pound Matthews bow, mushy, graceful, shot placement, 400 grain gold tip arrow with a two blade broadhead. Her 35 pound Matthews sent that arrow completely through that 600 pound antelope. Write that down. All you people who want to bow hunt and they give you a 60, 70 pound bow or the women out there that you have to shoot 50 pounds. No, you don't. You can shoot 20 pounds with a solid knife cutting two blade broadhead and shot placement. But anyhow, that's an Uncle Ted tech tip. We've been here for two and a half hours. A lot of deer, a lot of young bucks, a lot of beautiful does and fawns, big trophy button bucks. This is the spirit of the wild and it's so perfect. I can hardly stand it. Looks like I put a perfect heart shot on that hill country buck. I think we're gonna go fetch a buck, hug a buck, and snuggle with a buck right here on Spirit of the Wild. It's what I do, it's perfect. <laughs> 